Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the channel. Jack Graham here, Realtor with Simply Vegas, showing you today Heartland Falls. This is a beautiful new community built by Deer Horton in the north side of the Las Vegas Valley. As a matter of fact, we are up all the way north, right next to the mountains over there in the north side mountains. We're gonna tour today for you the 2,433 square feet floor plan. It's a two car garage with six, be five bedrooms actually, no, four bedrooms on this one. And then on that one up to five bedrooms and a loft. And uh, we have the 2665 next door that we're gonna tour. So two car garage. Now they do have an option here to add a third car garage. Those homes are coming up soon. And the third car garage is just gonna be an addition onto the side of the house. That increases the square footage of the lot from 4,000 square feet to, uh, which is what you have with these homes that you're gonna see today, to 5,000 square feet. But pretty much the same floor plan that you're gonna see today is what you're gonna get also with the three car garage if that's something that you want. With 2,433 square feet, right now with the two car garage option, we have, um, one available, well, it used to be available for $442. That's the price out the door. Now, we also have the $2665, which is the one next door. Then there is the uh, $2988 at uh, $480. And then the $2137 is the cheapest one with a $425,000 price range. Now, this one that we're going to see is selling for around $442, right? 2400 square feet i really like this floor plan because of how open the downstairs is for 2400 square feet however all the bedrooms are upstairs so if you're looking for a bedroom downstairs this might not be the right option for you six foot eight doors is standard in this home everything you're going to see in the house is going to be included <clears throat> we're going to go over those options together when you walk in you have your staircase going to the second floor then your powder room over here to the left Pedestal sink, toilet right there, a little bit of an area so you can put a, a little, you know, something to drop off your keys, like a drop off zone. And then we go into the open floor plan. Look at this. Very open space, spacious uh, living room, spacious dining room right here. And the kitchen uh, with an L-shaped floor plan here is very spacious. And I like how that dining room, I mean, that countertop right there, with the island is facing out here to the TV and living room. So that's great. Very, very nice floor plan. If uh, you don't need a bedroom downstairs, this is the one that you wanna look for. Your door entrance from the garage, which is now the sales office, so I can't show it to you. And also right here, we have that storage underneath the stairs with your smart panel that you see right there. Kitchen, 32 inch cabinets. Has a little crown molding as well. All the appliances that you see is what you get. You also get in this community, the refrigerator included. You have a nice corner pantry, which has a pretty good size. And then this uh, island is actually pretty, open, pretty wide, which is great. Nice and open to your living room and dining room. Love this floor plan. Now, shaker cabinets are included. Everything you see, they have a white color. They have a, also a gray color and a dark espresso brown color. Uh, so some options as far as the countertops they also have a white option for your countertops as well as this um, beautiful granite that they offer undermount sinks stainless steel and your faucet right there mowing faucets with your RO system faucet already installed although the RO system is an extra uh, thing that you have to add it after the fact so you can see plenty of room right here your coffee place is going to be right here Plenty of counter space here to cook. And your microwave with the hood venting to the outside. Right there, which is great. Pantry size. There it is. Good size pantry. <clears throat> and then the living room is spacious. Now the doors to the back are six foot eight. That kind of impedes a little bit of light from coming in, although it does feel so bright in here, which is great. Six foot eight. I wish these uh, doors were a little bit higher. But hey, at $440,000, it's gonna be tough to find in today's market. So to show you guys 
what uh, where we are located. We are located up all the way north. That's the north side mountains right there. If you get a nice lot like this one, you'll get some beautiful views in the back. However, you know, you do get a really good size back here. We are located, if you are not familiar with it, in Heartland. Heartland is a, is a new master plan community. It just opened a few months ago. And uh, they're creating this new community out here, similar to Aliante, which is, we're actually adjacent to Aliante in the casino right here. So you have everything you need right next to you within five minutes. Also, right around this year, they're gonna build a beautiful park a uh, church, elementary school. There's going to be, you know, trails where you can hike. As a matter of fact, right behind these communities back here, there are some trails that are, you know, a, a conserv they have a conservation easement where you cannot go there and uh, build any homes. And uh, right behind us here, we also have a park. It's a, there's a doggy park right here to the left and a community park right there. Now, the house does not come with a covered patio, so that's something that you would have to do after. Also, landscaping is not included. All you'll get is pretty much dirt here with a three by three piece of paver, just like you see it right there, those pavers. Everything else is just gonna be dirt, okay? They don't have any landscaping packages that they include. That's something you have to do after the fact. For a backyard this size, you're probably looking at around 10 grand or so to do the landscaping. Recess lights, pretty much everything you see is what you get. You get a ceiling fan here with the light, two lights in the living room, sorry, in the dining room, and then another two here in the hallway, another five in the kitchen. Okay. Now we're gonna go upstairs and then we're gonna go over to the second floor plan, which is the 2665. I believe that's my favorite floor plan out of uh, the ones that they offer here, out of the three that they have available. I would definitely option for a third car garage, but those are probably gonna be around 20 to $30,000 more expensive just because of that third car garage. When we go up to the left, all the way down, we have our primary bedroom. This will be your laundry room. And then to the right, we have one, two bedrooms over here. And then this huge loft right down there. This will be your bathroom in between. And so we're looking at one, two, three, and loft over there. I thought this was four. There it is, that's the fourth one right there. All right, let's start from here. As soon as we get upstairs, we have the first bathroom over here, two overmount sinks, mullein faucets, and white cabinets just like downstairs. We do get a 12 by 24 tile included downstairs throughout the full uh, first floor and also here in the bathrooms. Everywhere else is gonna be carpet. Well, that's nice because that's usually not included with any other builder unless you upgrade it. There we go. Fiberglass enclosure. We're gonna make our way down here. And this one has a closet right here. I'm guessing if you wanted to make this into a bedroom, you could. Well, not really. This is just an extra linen closet is what it is. Uh, you have a nice open uh, loft. This is very spacious. That, that couch is huge. Look how much room you have here on the side. There's a little nook right here if you want to put a desk, you know, work from home or whatever you want to do. Really nice. <clears throat> Going in here, we'll, fi we'll find right here your first bedroom. This one is actually uh, a little bit on the small side. Well, by small, I mean a 10 by 11 or so. Little closet right there. They're using it as, a, as an office. And then right here, we have the second bedroom. And as you can see right here, we have a little bit bigger bedroom about Maybe 10 by 12 or something like that. 10 and a half by 11. Slightly bigger. I mean, you could fit a queen size bed in here. You know, this is a twin size bed. And there's plenty of room. And the sliding door closet. Third bedroom is 
This is a very efficient floor plan, I would say. You know, four or four bedrooms and a loft with that huge open floor plan downstairs. It's really nice. 10 by 11, again, great space in here. Queen size bed you can fit. You have, uh, down here, you have your laundry room. As you can see, it has a rack on top. And then some extra room over here. No pre plumb for your sink, if that's what you want to do. And then you go in here to your primary bedroom. And uh, this is a king size bed. We've got plenty of room to walk around. So definitely a good size primary. Walking in here, we'll get a full walk-in walk shower to the right glass door and your linen closet right here also you'll get two under uh, two sinks over here with the cabin is kind of nice here in the corner hey when you go you can see yourself from the front from the side and from the other side right so you can hit that like button guys by the way if you haven't done so already subscribe to the channel if you want more videos video tours like these we'll Water closet, and then right here, your full walk-in closet. Which is a good size. Okay. Now, we saw this floor plan. We're gonna go next door and see the other one. That one has a full bedroom downstairs as well. So, again, you can get this home with the three-car garage option as well. And those are coming up soon. And that reminds me, by the way, if you guys are interested in any of these homes, available feel free to reach out to me all my information is down below in the description you know you can uh give me a call text message email whatever works for me uh just to get in touch with you and we can understand what, how i can help you uh to purchase a home out here in the las vegas valley whether you're coming from out of town i specialize in relocations i really master my uh my services when it comes to relocation because a lot of people come out here to town and they have no idea where to go they have no idea what this neighborhood looks like where is it located all that stuff through technology and uh, all the tools that I have available I educate my clients where they're gonna be as far as location where is the best place for them and then we get them into the right house for them so uh, really cool process I would love for you to be part of it and uh, earn your business so gain to give you that knowledge that you need in order to purchase a home in the right part of the town, first of all, because location, 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 right? And um, second, uh, make sure you guys are happy with the floor plan and also guide you throughout the whole process when it comes to all the contract and all the inspections that you need to do on the home, uh, which are much needed on new construction homes from personal experience. Anyway, all my information is down below in the description. You also have two links if you're not quite ready yet. You can check those out uh, down there where you can look at uh, new construction homes or resale homes, depending on what you want. Over here we have uh, the 2665. Right now they have uh, a little banner right here, but that's going to be a two-car garage. Then uh, again, option, you can get the third-car garage right there. As we go into the house... Got a staircase to the second floor to the right. Cool closet. This is right now an office. They locked them up, so you don't want people to see it, but two car garage. And then nice open floor plan on this one. This is my favorite as again, it really maximizes everything and the square footage that you have. And this one is going for 455 out the door. Got the full shower because right across from the hallway here, we have your laundry room, first of all, to the left. Washer and dryer are included, by the way. And then the full bedroom downstairs. And this one is a 10 by 12. Good size. Sliding door closets right there. And we go into your living room and it's very spacious. Your kitchen right here in the corner. Great size island. Uh, kitchen cabinets, I wish it had a little bit more, but still it's a great amount. And uh, 32 inch cabinets, just like the other one. This is one of the other options that they have. You can see the granites and the great cabinets underneath. You can mix and match these. Sometimes they do the white with this countertop. Oh, something to keep in consideration. 
And then a great size dining room and the living room is very spacious. So they really maximize the square footage here. As far as the backyard goes, it's pretty much the same size as the one next door. You can definitely put in a pool in these backyards if that's what interests you. But yeah, Heartland Manor, uh, sorry, Heartland Falls is this collection. And uh, we're located in the north side of Las Vegas Valley with this beautiful community that they're building. If you guys want more information, I also have a full map of Heartland and what they're building out here. So feel free to reach out to me, you know, and then uh, once we get in touch, I'll send you over a picture of, uh, of the full neighborhood and what they're doing out here. As you walk up, you have, I think this is a linen closet. Primary bedroom. One, two, three bedrooms and a game room or loft. That one does not have a closet, but you can also easily turn it into a bedroom. And then right here you have the bathroom to the left, which is gonna be the bathroom that everybody's gonna share. Door here to the fiberglass enclosure, tub and shower combo. And first bedroom right here, a little bit more on the smaller side compared to the other bedroom, still spacious enough. I mean, you could fit a queen size bed in here. Slide into our closet. And then second one, this is the game room that I talked to you about. You could easily add a closet right here and make it a huge bedroom. Um, you know what I wish this house had? An extra bedroom here with its own bathroom, like an ensuite. I feel like that would have been sick. But it's great to have all this extra room here too. Uh, you know, especially if you have a lot of kids, this would be a great place for them to come and play. They can even shut the door so if they're playing video games or something, you don't hear them. Bedroom over here, very spacious. Uh, what is that? 11 by 12, maybe more than that, 12 by 13. It's a good size. Can easily fit a queen size bed, maybe even a king. Same size this one pretty much. Look how much room you have here on the side. Easily queen size bed. And then sliding our closet in this one as well. Every room is gonna come with a light. Everything is included in here. And last but not least, you have your primary. Now this one is very roomy. Look at that. Awesome. And uh, two windows, your full bathroom here, walk-in shower, two sinks. Water closet and then full walk-in closet in here. And then it loops around here to give you even more space. So that's nice. You can even add some extra racks there if you want. And then closet and the full walk-in shower here with the glass enclosure. Let me know what you guys think down in the comments. All my information is down there as well. Uh, if you guys need any help purchasing a home, love to represent you and earn your business. Um, yeah, let me know what you guys think. What, what about these prices? I mean, we're looking at 425 for the smallest one, 2100 square feet, 442 for the 2443 that we saw the first model. Then we have two, uh, this model right here for 456. And then the last one, the biggest one is the 2988 at 480. Uh, you know, you can check out the other floor plan, the 2988. You just Google on YouTube 2988, uh, Jack Graham and Oak show up. I've done it, you know, a few times that video um, to see at least the floor plan. But, you know, 480, that's a really good price up here in, in this neighborhood. Uh, there is a SID in this community. I think it's around $16,000 for... Uh, for that you have to pay on top of that. Now that fee does not come out, out of pocket right away. It's about 1,500 every, every year or so that you have to pay, uh, unless you pay it off up front. But there is a prepayment uh, penalty fee for this community if you were to do that. So keep that in mind, okay? Uh, really nice location up here. They call it the Summerlin of the North. Um, something that you can definitely consider if you're coming out here to purchase a home and live out here in, the, in one of these neighborhoods. 
And, um, and yeah, if you have any questions, let me know. Thank you so much for watching. Hit the like button, subscribe to the channel for more videos like these, and I'll see you on the next one.